Hi, I'm Margaret Witchcrafty. I wanted to do a little throwback to one of Nintendo's earlier games, Metroid, with a little lava plush. And whether you're a space pirate that wants to harness their power, or a Samus who's protecting them, here's how you can make your own. Here's a list of everything you'll need. Pause here if you need to. The pattern is available for free in the description for my deviant art. Make sure to follow the key in the top left hand corner before you cut it out. The first thing you need to do is take one of the body sides and join the three red circles on the upper half of the side with no tracing. After that, sew up the tiny dart at the bottom of each green body piece. Then, place the body piece with the circles and one without together, with the tracing facing up, and sew them together along one side. Repeat with two of the plain green pieces. Place these two pieces together with the tracing facing up and sew them together leaving the bottom straight edges open. Then take the small red strips and sew up each little dart on all four. Take two of the eight white claws and join two pieces together along the top leaving the bottom open. Align the bottom spikes to one of the four claw pieces and join it around the remaining open spike leaving the straight edge open. Once done, flip it the right way up and stuff it. Repeat for the remaining three claws.
Align the claws with the red pieces and join the top of the claws to the sloped edge on each side so that the shorter red edge with the dart aligns with the bottom of the claw and the longer red side aligns to the green body pieces. The claws should point to the side with no tracing. Repeat this until all of the red pieces and the claws are joined in a circle around the bottom of the green body pieces. Lastly, take the bottom red circle and begin joining it to the bottom of the red pieces and the claw bottoms between them. When you've nearly closed off the bottom, flip it the right way up, stuff it and close off the open end with an invisible stitch. And that is how you make a Metroid Lava Plush. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and comment down below on ideas that you'd like to see me make next. And while you're at it, why don't you go check out my other videos? I upload new videos every single week. Thanks for watching. Bye.